Hey, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today, I will show you how to create a new category and add category into the blog post. So let's get started. Now I'm going to start API server and also start the Angular 2 application. So we have an API server and now we need to create a new model. Let's create a new one and by typing SLC loopback model. Now model name will be category category. So probably name will be the title will be string and decryption decryption string as well. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to restart the API server again now you can see the category here okay and now we need to to connect category to the port and one category can be have a more post and the post will be belong to category so let's create a relationship by src slc loop back and relation now a category have a more purse has has many purse Okay, now one again. At RC, SLC loop back relation again. Now the pods belong to category. Okay, so I'm going to restart API Silver again. now and refresh now you can see one category can be have a port here so that means we can able to get all the ports belong to category ID and in the post model we have also category ID this will be related to the relation to category by primary key is the category ID. So I will create, create some example of category. For example, now let's will be Drupal. Hey, Drupal is awesome. Okay. Cool. And one more category, WordPress. That's well. Now. Okay, so we have a two gallery. You can see by get methods. We have a two gallery here. So 
Let's open the project in WebStorm. Now I'm open the Angular application in web browser. See. In the last video, we have a block and I look out and log in again with my account. That's mean. And so we have a block crest, a new block part. Mm. Test block. Hey, test block content. So the bl block form work well. However, now we need to add the category selection here. So by that open site and let us see an application in a block block form. So now we need to add a new tree like list by here. This class equal form verb label. Sorry, label for gallery for category. Um, Like name will be category and NZ model, and we have an option. Option will be um, okay. So how we we get the list of category here? Now in the part form component. Now I am going to. Uh, okay, so I will create read new file in from here block in a category model TS. So it pros class category. In contract layer, so we have a public and ID. ID will be optional. String and name, name optional. Will be string as well. Uh, sorry, the category will be have a title. And copy that. Well, and also description will be string as well. So in post form now we have a that's a category. Now we'll be up an array of category. Sorry. You can see the category model has been imposed imposed by Web Store. Okay. So we have a new cat equal new empty array. Now we let's create a new function. In post model, uh, in post service, we need to create a new function. Guess category by let's URL equal this dot server URL. Plus, now, how we know the API endpoint? In category, we have an endpoint will be slash category. So let's copy that in. Sorry. Now return this dot http dot URL, and also will be header with this dot header. Just map response will be less to JSON as category. 
sorry, sorry, array. We also get the error, error. observable dot throw error. Now the function will be observable, observable. Will be a category an array. So in the first form in, the, in this function, throw the params with map. Okay. This does yes category. So we can simply do that. This does force of it does get category. The surprise and respond will be a function. This does category equal res. Now we also if error we lock to the console error. So we have a category here and we can loop yes to select this option and z4 and let's category up category and now will be cast.title title and you have a ng ng value will be um cat id and we have an ID category and ng model. Sorry, ng model. ng model will be um, post dot category categories ID. Uh, we don't have a category ID in the post model. Let's open post dot model. Post Post model will be have a public carry ID. Now set it optional with string as well. So okay, so let's let's see. And space. So cool, we have two gallery display here. And so make it a bit now plot equal form control. It's a good job start. Okay. So we have a carry here. And and one we now I will let that and make a test post by a part with category belong to um, Drupal. Okay, you like Drupal? Hey, hey Drupal, and save it as yes, special and okay. So we have a post with category belong to Drupal, and here is a post ID. Now I'm copy that to in the post. Now I will get the post by ID. Okay, and copy ID, pass. And we have a post title here, and body, and also my account ID. And this is a category, category. Now I'm going to copy the category ID and view all the parts belong to. So in, in category model, now in get category ID and pass the category ID here and we will get, I'm sorry, we get the parts belong to category here by pass the ID and see. 
here we go we have a, a post below to this category ID and now we see the edit form okay it's automatically select by default Drupal so let's make another test and a, a new post belong to WordPress so I'm going to select WordPress hey and Chris okay so we have a post ID here and I'm going to get the post by get the post ID and copy ID and try so we have a post here and here is the WordPress gallery ID now I am going to to set the gallery ID and view the post belong to WordPress so in I here I'm sorry in here guess and pass the ID here now and try out so we have it all the posts belong to WordPress gallery ID so in the next video we will create a list of gallery and also list all the posts belong to gallery so bye for now and have a nice day thanks for watching